Good morning and welcome back to Ms. Linda's video classroom. This morning I have a special read, a read aloud because this morning's read aloud is dedicated to a very special boy, Bryson, who turned one yesterday. And I will be at his birthday party this afternoon. So I bought this book for him for his birthday and fell in love with it. So I actually, I'm giving it away this afternoon. I will have to buy myself another copy for my classroom. Um, but I love it. I love the message. I love the illustrations. And when I read it to my fiance, Keon, this morning, it actually made me cry. So hopefully I won't cry as I do this video today. But um, I'm going to introduce it now. It is called, I Am Every Good Thing. And it was written by Derek Barnes and illustrated by Gordon C. James. So here we go. Every good thing. Let's do it this way. Let's adjust this camera. Here we go. All righty. I am a nonstop ball of energy, powerful and full of light. I am a go-getter, a difference maker, a leader. My video won't actually do justice to the illustrations. Please go buy the book yourself. I am every good thing that makes the world go round. You know, like gravity or the glow of moonbeams over a field of brand new snow. I am good to the core, like the center of a cinnamon roll. Yeah, that good. I am skateboard tricks, scraped knees, and elbows. But you know what? I am right back on my feet again. I am one eye open, one eye closed, peeking through a microscope, gazing through a telescope, checking out the spaces around me, and plotting out those far-off places I have yet to go, but will. I am a gentleman and a scholar. I am kind and polite, like, yes, ma'am, and yes, sir, helping my grandmother cross the street and saying, bless you, when a stranger has to sneeze. I'm a cool breeze, a perfect paper airplane that glides for blocks for miles forever. I love this one. I love this illustration. I am a roaring flame of creativity. I am a lightning round of questions and a star-filled sky of solutions. I am an explorer planting a flag on every square foot of this planet where I belong. I am a sponge soaking up information, knowledge, and wisdom. I want it all, and I am all ears. I love this one. I am Saturday mornings in the summertime. I am two bounces and a front flip off the diving board. I am hilarious. I am the life of the party. I am that smile forming on your face right now. I am the boom bap, boom boom bap when the bass line thumps and the kick drum jumps. I'm the perfect beat, the perfect rhyme, keeping everything on point and always on time. But you already knew that. I am a grand slam, bases fully loaded. I'm a nasty two-handed dunk holding on to the rim. Just to remind you that I'm still the man. Believe that. I am the undisputed champion. I am a highlight reel of magnificence. I am the celebration, the applause, and the standing ov ovation. I am victory. I 
I am a brother, a son, a nephew, a favorite cousin, a grandson. I am a friend. I am real. I am tight hugs, a hand to hold, a shoulder to cry on. If you have to, I hope you never have to. I am here. Although I am something like a superhero, every now and then, I am afraid. I am not what they might call me, and I will not answer to any name that is not my own. I am what I say I am. I am that sound in the forest when the mighty tree falls. I am waves crashing gently on the shore. I am a force of nature, a miracle, a blessing. I am brave. I am hope. I am my ancestors' wildest dream. I am worthy of success, of respect, of safety, of kindness, of happiness. And without a shadow of a doubt, I am worthy to be loved. I am worthy to be loved. Bryson, this is for you. You are a blessing. You are worthy to be loved. And this is also for all the wonderful black and brown boys that I teach every day at my job. You are every good thing. Thank you for sharing this time with me. Bryson, I love you.